work was my identity and I always thought that that's one place where I'm doing really well. The respected salesperson is actually my own journey in uncovering my own negative association with the sales profession. The real problems that salespeople actually have how to manage debilitating anxiety, procrastination, fear of rejection. I started gaining empathy for the sales profession. I wanted to actually provide a solution. So this book is also about championing the sales profession and realizing that actually everyone is in sales, not just a few people, because of course, you are going out there asking people out on a date. You're making your children eat vegetables, <laughs> right? You're constantly negotiating. You're going on an interview. You are selling yourself. So everyone is is a sales professional and I think we need to bring respect back into sales. I've been fortunate enough to have read the book. My philosophy prior to reading the book was always just, you know, have a thick skin, move on, don't take it too personally, just just try to keep going. But after reading the book and, and hearing uh, how many ways there are in which you can train yourself and, and how you can train your mind to, to become better and, and be more confident and have have that built-in respect for you. Sales can sort of be misinterpreted sometimes as, as maybe a, a profession that lacks skill or lacks integrity or can be a bit of an easy thing to do. And, and it's really not. Um, it takes quite a lot of courage, um, a lot of empathy, a lot of understanding about the human connection. Because at the end of the day, people buy from other people, people who understand that connection and understand how to make connections with others really, really are the most successful at this profession. It starts with you know, how you feel about yourself first more than anything.